Hello. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. Right, first one of oops, first one of 2022 and uh, happy new year to everybody right we're going up and i should have memorized these but i can't remember them all we're supposed to be doing four hopefully uh wayne writes today one is uh angletarn pikes which is near angletarn another one's called the knot um i think one's called dodds rise maybe and another one but we'll check that out on the map again in a bit and uh, as soon as we do, we'll let you know. But we've uh, parked in a lovely little car park there. The weather seems to be brightening up a touch. There's a lot of um, a lot of water around. A lot of low cloud, but the forecast is not too bad. So we'll just see how it goes. So catch you in a bit. Been going long, but this is the, one of the first bridges. Like I say, plenty of water around. I don't know if that's a pumping station or what, but it is quite, for the time of year, it's quite mild, but uh, still a bit fresh, so we've, uh, we're fully layered up. In about 10 minutes we'll be regretting it because we'll be sweating our nuts off, but as we've got to go up this, so anyway. I'll... All right, well, it's only quarter to 10, making good progress. Well, there's plenty of water around, as I'm sure you can see from this. There's the filter house down there. Sun's breaking out over there, but it is spotting the rain a bit, so... But that waterfall looks fantastic, and just around the corner here is horse water. So, I better look like a Belisha beacon already. We are warming up quite a bit. Harry's warming up. I'm warming up. But uh, yeah, so the plan is to do, like I say, the four Wayne rights, which I've forgotten them again now. Uh, no, it's the Knot, Raised Dodd, uh, Angled Tarn Pikes, and oh, I've forgotten the other one. Next time, next time. Anyway, let's get on. Hey, water, water everywhere. It does seem to be brightening a bit, but we are getting this mist coming in and uh, the odd shower, but we'll be right. cold now but because we're up in the mist and it's uh, closing in a bit that ascent there was boggy as anything just a bootful nice to clean off a bit but looks good in the valley where we've come from we're up here which is a knot which you can't see because it's in the cloud Anyway, let's get going. 
trying to listen, Jim. It's a bit windy up here at 2,000 feet. We'll listen again in the car on the way home, maybe. Sounds good, though. We've got to go up there, yeah? That's where we're going. That's uh, rest stop. 2,000 something feet. 300 something. And then... Uh, over there, the one you can't see, called something cracks. Rubbish. Right, it's windy. Left back from the wind for 10 seconds. strong breeze across the lake. Right, well, <laughs> we've just had lunch. Through wind, rain, pestilence, locusts, you name it, we've had everything. And this has been the view overlooking Angletown. There are a few people walking past and stuff. Uh, on the opposite side so we've just got to negotiate getting round and down and back over to that path over there then um, up on top of there which is Angleton Pikes and then we'll start wending our way down we've been sat for about half an hour or more and uh, we're pretty bloody cold and wet now so we're gonna crack on aren't we Harry? Gonna have some warm up and walking indeed <laughs> let's go We've just been round something Hornus Corner or something like that. You can see the traffic in the distance, but you can pick it up. Um, coming down off Kirkstone Pass, 
looks like it's in the cloud going up and over so we'll see what happens see if we can get some grub there then back you've got the welcoming sight of Patterdale in the clouds and it's fucking raining again so no surprise there oh, very good day, we? we're on the way down we're getting jelly legs now because it's quite a steep descent but then as soon as we're down changing the car get out of this lot and get off and try and get some grub somewhere so see you in a bit I'm really losing the light now uh, don't know what you can see but there's a crazy waterfall up there lovely but yeah it's too dark to film now so you can tell that because you can only see Harry there he is I'm here anyway we're nearly at the bottom so right probably can't see us because of the light it's a bit dark uh, but we've finished the walk uh, nearly eight miles all in total wet wild windy we've had it all just pulled in at the King's Head um, had something to eat which is very nice so we're all fueled up another good walk and uh, hopefully catch you on the next one